would you be gay? Right now? <laughs> From French to gay, I don't know. Which well, one that's, I would his, that's the gateway. Would Jack. I be gay? Be gay. Could you say more words so you know how to answer that? <laughs> what? <laughs> would I be gay? Mm-hmm. Come on, more. <laughs> if, if, would I be gay if? what? Would you be gay if? Just in general. Would you, you be, gay? be gay? I actually like the would you be philosophical. Gay? Yeah, yeah, we're be, being French would right now. Would you be gay? Yeah. We're in a cafe, Give, Given dude. the opportunity, given the... Hey, that's for you to... Whatever. Where there's circumstances. Yeah, uh, sure, why not? You don't need circumstances. No. Like, would if you I just had gay? an emotional and, like, romantic attraction to a guy, would you just... Would, I would go you with it? Indulge in it. Like, I would be scared, and I would contemplate going towards that fear. Because of public scrutiny? I'll tell you a moment that I felt I almost became gay. So see a lot, sort of, like... <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, let's Come go. On. On. Okay, I was, it was uh, 16, 17, living in uh, where I grew up in Newton, Massachusetts. And we had, a, uh, my friends and I did a lot of drugs. Mm. And a friend of ours took us to a downtown Boston loft show. It was like a concert in somebody's loft apartment. Okay. And it was super cool. And yeah. I felt so cool being there. And a friend of mine knew some of the bands, so I got to meet them. I'm 16, I'm 17, smoking pot, you know? And uh, so we're leaving the loft. We're going down these stairs that are going like this. And some guys are going up because it's continuing. And one guy goes, hey. And I look up and there's a guy at the top of the stairs and he goes, and he's wearing like uh, Buddy Holly glasses or something. This is the 80s. And he says, hey. And I go, what? And he goes, where are you going? And I said, well, we're leaving. And he goes, you're cute. And I said, thanks. And he said, come back up. And for one second, I thought, that's a choice up there. That's just going going back up, hmm. letting my friends go back to Newton and being gay. Up there. <laughs> that was a choice. Yeah. But I looked at him and then I went forward in my head to the big, you know, cock coming all in my face. And yeah, yeah. I was like, nah, so let's go home. So homosexuality is a choice is what yeah. we're taking from this. <laughs> For me at the moment, it was. A homosexual act would have been a choice. That's always a choice. Yes. An act is always a well, choice. Well, it was like, a na what's my nature? Is that my nature? Is that what I want? Is this, you know, I liked things about the moment. I liked that he was invited. He was an, a, a grown up and I was reaching out to wanting to be a grown up. And he validated me. And I like, yes, that he validated me yeah. and that he said, I want you to come up and hang out with these grown ups that you don't even know. Yeah. That was interesting. But then when I added the gay sex angle in my head, yeah. I thought, that taints the moment for me. I don't want to. Because do the that. sex part. I don't want to have sex with a man. I don't desire men sexually. But we want validation from men. Sure. And we want to feel yeah. cool. And you're at the cool loft and party. Then, and that age, you just, if 100%. someone gives you that, you know, you go. Oh, yeah, I want to hang out with you. You made me feel like that. Do you think if you weren't already- I liked him too. I liked the way he talked. He was assertive. Something about him, I, he seemed open and cool and like- Fatherly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He's like, I'm <laughs> going to fuck that guy. I'm going to fuck that kid. Come on up here. This is my French. God, good for you. You're French, man. I'm not sure. You have a French right. honesty, dude. I think that you're, I think you're from where you are from in the world. Where am I from? Like stupid land, I would call it. <laughs> 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 I know that you're a lot smarter than you seem. I'm a dumb guy. Yeah, you act like a dumb guy because you make know. you I make don't... money acting like a dumb guy. <laughs> okay, but you're smart. You're educated. You were raised with a lot I of went money. To a party school. Yeah, that's my parents. People with money, intelligent people with money, go to party schools. Oh, my parents Fuck, didn't have dude. crazy money. Wow, that... that's true, right? Fuck. My yeah. parents taught dance lessons for a living. How much money can you make doing that? You tell me. I don't know. I won't Millions tell you. Millions of no, dollars. Don't, don't tell him. <laughs> Again, you always tell him the money. Come on, yeah, you, gotta, you gotta get him to say something. No, but uh, no, I, I grew up in the East Village. You know, yeah. And there was like a. You grew there was up a in the East Village. Astor Place. Wow. And there was a French Astor influence. Place. Yeah. Yeah, sure. By Starbucks. Did you just question whether it was the fucking East Village yes, for a second? Yes, I did. I didn't dislike you until that <laughs> moment of this podcast, and I almost wanted to punch you in your head. You looked wow, over so at important. Joe that's... like Joe was going to know what the fuck the East Village was. I confirmed. You guys are it from It wasn't Boston. Joe, it was anybody. What the fuck do you know about New York? <laughs> you moved to the West Village. You're right. Around at loft right. parties. 
Okay. You're right. Jesus You're right. Christ, these hipsters. Well, the Bushwick is the real place. Do you see right how now. important it is to if him he's that he's from the East Village? He's nothing if he's not a New Yorker. That's it. Well, That's my identity. New Yorker, East Village. Yeah. That's yes. how important that is to you. But yeah. no, it was just well, that you, you know what, what the hell is of growing up on Astro Place. But can I be honest? Is with that you? you're not quite there and you'll <laughs> never <laughs> fucking live there. No, you're close. Right now we're on Lafayette. You're in the fucking border. You wish you were East Village. Well, no, this isn't East Village. This is like Nolita Soho. You wish you were East Village. You wish you were like with Leonard Cohen and people like smoking hatch. I don't know who those but people are. But you live in East Village. You're nice. Who... You had nice parents. You were sheltered. You yeah, had good it life. It was beautiful. It was a great life. Um, you're a Mexican. <laughs> I am. <laughs> no, no, but real quick, you, you, were, you were right about the insecurity wasn't, it's what the East Village is now. East Village has moved over. Yeah. People who live in Alphabet City go, oh, I live in the East Village. Before that wasn't. Yes. But now that it's moved over, now where I grew up is like NoHo. And now I've lost my East yeah, Village I identity. How that feels. And that's what you were tapping into. So you were, you I were right about that. I understand how that feels. I get that it. insecurity came out. I'll be honest. I think insecurity is not, uh, people always want to get rid like of it. You're like a French but investigator. But it's from somewhere real. Yeah. Yeah, I'm like, like Cousteau. Cousteau. You're yeah. fucking yeah. Jock. You said Cousteau. 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 <laughs> <laughs> you no, got your... He investigated underwater. Yes, he did. Yeah, don't judge. He, Whatever he one man. Fishing. He said, what neighborhood do you think you're yeah, from? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Mr. Marlin. Yeah. Uh, yeah, the East Alphabet Bad City used to have its own character its own it was its own place yes it was and now it's kind of yeah been gentrified by you people moving here to follow your dreams yeah to our great city yeah me the mexicans gentrified. yeah the mexicans coming in that's right now you lie a lot about being mexican <laughs> can, can you you're a big time liar about being mexican can you cut that shit out a little bit why do you think it's lie do you speak spanish claro que si no hablas espanol wey hablas espanol claro Go ahead. <laughs> yo, 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 he was struggling. Yo creo que no hablas español. ¿Dónde aprende uh, español? You don't speak Spanish, Louis. <laughs> Shut that fucking shit up already. Un, Viví un en España. poco, así, así. Viví en España. Uh, Viví un año en España. Okay. Y también trabajé en muchos restaurantes. Y, uh -huh. oh, y ahí okay. aprendí Entonces, español. Entonces, ¿estás español? No. Claro que sí. No, Porque, no, no. Uh, Eres español, no estás. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Yeah, it's a grammar. That's what makes a person a person. Isn't it? <laughs> don't be defensive. Don't be defensive. Yeah, you're really East-villaging this right now. I know, you I really am. are. I own, I, I own it. I'm Listen, defensive about it. You but are, you don't even know anything about why I'm Mexican. I mean, why do you think... Do you really think I don't know why you're Mexican? I don't know anything about what you know. I hope this ends in a fist fight. Yeah, right? <laughs> <laughs> like, like, way more I just kick the shit out of each other. I do my research. Yeah. I know about these things. Research is me-search. Mm. Oh. What? Now... <laughs> That's a saying. <laughs> What? It's the same when you're when you're when doing you research, research, you're find, searching yourself. Yeah. It's mm. like when you're writing, you're always writing about yourself, even if you think you're not writing about yourself. Mm. That's I'm true. a smart motherfucker too. I'm French. I, I want to be French. Oh, I'll make out with a man right now. <laughs> 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 Mark is giving the opportunity. Invite him upstairs. Come on. We've got some spiral stairs. Yeah, we do. Did you feel when you walked up those stairs? They weren't spiral, but I like that image it's a better. half the spiral. Don't tell people what's on the back end. Yeah. I didn't go back there. I don't know anything. Uh, I believe in that. I trust that if you tell me that's a spiral staircase. Yeah. You want to go for a walk up the staircase? No, but I, 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 it's there. Can I try again? Hey. Hey. Where are you going? <laughs> <laughs> If, it, if that guy had done that, it would have been like, fuck. No, no, no. <laughs> See, you guys don't know how to act. You don't know how to pick up. You don't know how to pick up a teenage boy. Uh, damn, bro. <laughs> okay, okay. You don't no, no. act sexy with a teenage boy. You, 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 you act cool. You, hey, what's up? Come on. Oh, fuck. Is that cool? I mean, it almost worked on me. That's why I know it. Right, 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 right. right. Cool's changed, yeah. Um, yeah, yeah. So, 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 it's all good. We all get old, bro. And yeah. okay, am so, I the oldest person here? I think so, right? What do you mean? Do think? you really have to ask that question? What do you Double. think? What do you fucking think? Oh my god! <laughs> Break out the yeah. font on your iPhone again, and then. <laughs> <laughs>